Uh, we're hanging out with Duff McKagan's Loaded uh, here at 92.7, 98.5 The Planet. Uh, of course, going to be at the uh, V Club tonight in Huntington, 741 6th Avenue. And uh, the new album is sick, and uh, that was Flatline, and that was uh, awesome. That was killer. Thank you. So uh, I know you guys uh, plug it in at night, but uh, the acoustic stuff is uh, really, really freaking good. Well, you know, uh, sitting around on a bus with three acoustic guitars, you, you start to uh, go in the back lounge and learn cover songs and uh you know the, the version of flatline acoustic obviously is different than the sure the rocked out version but uh yeah it's something we really enjoy doing playing acoustically now what's uh what's what's the band like live and, and plugged in and, and at night and that kind of stuff what's your show is like what what can we expect tonight at the, at the b club rock okay <laughs> yeah yeah uh, we are, we're, we're a rock and roll band. We're, we're, we're tight. You know, we, we, uh, we've been playing for 10 years yeah. and this is what we do. And it, I know for me at this point in my life, I, I am a lifer. This, sure. And uh, I think, you know, I, it, I know it says it in this, in the song, but, and not to, no pun intended, but we really, we, we wear it on our sleeve and, um, we're, it's not a, a commercial device for, for, you know, commerce. It's just. Not, we're just a rock and roll band out touring, having fun, all yeah. that kind of good stuff. We, it, we allow ourselves to take some chances too. It gets pretty fun. Sure. Right now. Yeah. Now, sure. can we expect any uh, any covers tonight? Any any, any jokes? Yeah, yeah. Any yeah, jokes? Yeah, yeah. Some jokes? Yeah, yeah. Long jokes. Yeah. Long jokes. Yeah. We drink a lot of Red Bull yeah. on stage, and <laughs> mm-hmm. so there's some long-winded segments. Sometimes. I've caught myself talking and and realizing in my head something goes off like wow you've been talking for a really long time. <laughs> <laughs> people don't notice. Don't scare people away. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They do. Yeah. Uh, we have a, a, yeah we play some covers we play we play all kinds of stuff and and you know we've heard people scream out songs and. And and we'll play them. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Nice. Yeah. No, I saw like a, I I did uh, did some YouTube action and, and I saw like a couple of covers of like uh, not really, I don't know if you call it a cover but doing like it's so easy and, and yeah. so fine and all those and and, and I do got to say I think uh, your all's version of it's so easy is just it's badass just the way it, it sounds it doesn't sound like Guns N' Roses I just think it sounds cool I mean, yeah I, I don't it know what cool. you call that is that a, uh, it's not really a cover it's yeah I know, I know. what is it <laughs> I don't know it's, 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 it's... you're doing the song. We're doing a song. Yeah, yeah. You're doing the song. Yeah. Interpretation. It's, it's loaded. To, wow. Yeah, interpretation. Yeah, Alternate version. Alternate version. Yeah. Big brain. Look at it's multi. <laughs> it's it's really fun to play. That. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. For us, we love playing. Uh, I guarantee it. I guarantee it. Multi syllable word. <laughs> multi. What? Multi syllabic. Syllabic. Yeah. Now, can, can we uh, can we briefly talk about some some Guns N' Roses stuff and Velvet Revolver stuff just for a few few minutes here? Yeah, and I gotta say though, yeah, uh, driving in here this morning, we, we were driving into the, the mountains. Sure. Like I I woke up about eight, and uh, started drinking coffee, and we're just rolling through these the mountains. But it's really beautiful country around. It is. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. I'm glad. I mean, I'm glad you're enjoying. And the then area we enough. rolled past Marshall. I'm like, oh man, we're here. <laughs> we're here. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even realize that. That's where we were coming. <laughs> but we're in we're in the, the sacred land. There we go. Yeah. Um. What, what do you think about the fact that uh, that that Guns N' Roses is still that big? I mean, the, the legacy of the band is still, you know, people still buy Appetite and, and still buy the the Illusion albums and, and listen to them all the way through. I mean, we get requests for s- songs that weren't really singles; just they just want to hear uh, "It's So Easy" and and um, um, you know, Mr. Brownstone, all those kind of stuff. They they want to hear those songs yeah. still. What do you I mean? What do you think about that? Looking back on it, I, you know, it's not like I look back on it because it's just my life, okay. and and so it's it's hard for me to really get on the outside and take a a, a full view of what it is. Right. It's it's it happened to me, and it still happens, and people freak out still, and you go to other countries, and people freak out, and everywhere, you know, you kind of go. It's not, you know, I can cut my hair off and 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 be sort of like the guy and go anywhere I want, really. Right. Um, but. Uh, I don't know. It's a trip. Yeah. I I guess it's the only, that's the easiest way to put it. Now has uh has, has Slash come into any loaded shows on the on uh? Slash has played with the loaded group. Oh before. sweet. Mm-hmm. Sure. Where did that happen at? Uh, that was at the House of Blues. Yeah, and also at the uh. Yeah. Slash likes to you know Slash likes to play. He's a music guy. He's a music guy. Good yeah. He'll play the yeah the opening of a. Envelope, as they say. No, he likes he like the guy. Just he's a consummate musician. He sure. just loves to to play his guitar and 
Yeah. Um, so yeah, Matt. Matt's a big fan of the sure. band. Uh, Dave Kushner used to be and filled in for Mike okay. for some loaded shows okay. back in. Um, Gilby's <laughs> come out. Gilby's come out. Sure. Um, Ron Wood, Keith Richards. That's that's, that's Jimmy Page, Brian nice. May. There you go. Taylor, Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift came out. Yeah. 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 Kelly Pickler. Yeah. <laughs> Brad Paisley, big fan. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Joan Baez did that. We did that. That was awesome. That was killer. Yeah, that was really, really good. Good. The Van Morrison version of Wasted Heart was awesome. Too. <laughs> yeah. It was. That was good. Yeah. That was all right. With Dylan, we did the. Uh, right. He kind of blew it. Right. Yeah, he, <laughs> he was so bad. stoned. He was really yeah. stoned. Yeah. I mean, the come on. Burt Backrack, that had to be the, the top of me. Burt Backrack yeah. version of Wasted Heart. Yeah. It's really <laughs> good. It's so easy, but. <laughs> oh, that's right. I forgot about that one. I couldn't believe he could play the piano and the cowbell at the same time. Yeah. Really, really <laughs> yeah. Now, well, well, talking about being a music guy, what would you be doing if uh, if you didn't? Uh, if, if Guns N' Roses and any band that you were in never had any success, what, w- what would you be doing? Like, could you work in a hat shop? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What are the Have you ever thought about that? What, like, what, what we, what you, or you just be still playing in clubs, <clears throat> just doing what we gotta do? I was that kid that, you know, everybody said, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, you better think about what, what job you're gonna have or what, you know, what community college you're gonna go to. Yeah, okay. Um, and I was, I just had the blinders on the whole time. So, for me to talk now about what I would have done. Sure. I never thought about it. You know, I had jobs like everybody else. I worked in construction. I was a cook and, you know, dishwasher and you name it. But uh, I always knew this is what I was going to do. Awesome. But, of course, if if I wasn't going to do this, I'd probably be president of the United States of America. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, uh, can we hear Well, that? you know, I, sh- I want to be the treasury guy well yeah we'll talk about that in a minute which which is uh real real interesting. i got it all down okay i, I know exactly what i do okay well again we're, we're chatting <laughs> you with really want to go there <laughs> <laughs> maybe we'll get you on one of our am stations or something like that one yeah. of the news talk stations yeah. uh we're hanging out with uh with loaded the new album is uh is sick and they'll be at the b club tonight 741 6th avenue in huntington doors open at eight uh band start at nine only uh 15 bucks at the door and uh can we uh hear another tune we can we're gonna play uh Oh, do you have a question? No, I was just stretching out a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we haven't even got to any jokes, really. I don't have any clean jokes. I don't have radio jokes, so. The paint joke? Can you tell the paint joke? Oh, that's a good one. Go ahead. Mike Squire's on the joke. You're the joke guy. Right? No. Like you, you tell it so dry, though. What's red and smells like blue paint? I don't know. Red paint. <laughs> 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 yeah. <laughs> it's more than just a rock show tonight.